spinning wheel increased spin his output. But it wasn't until 1764, when Lancastrian James Hargreaves had a brainwave, that spinners could really step up production. His invention was the spinning jenny. The spinning jenny worked on the same principle as the spinning wheel. And here we have the right mix. The unspun cotton. And that's thread on there. On four drawers, that's bags and drawers four times, could spin half a mile of cotton. So in the old days, six spinners would work to supply one weaver. Now, one man spinning on this could supply eight weavers. Cash. The journey took cotton out of the home and into the workshops, signing the death knell for spinning as a cottage industry. Hey, what's up guys? Kyle here, and today we're going to be talking about James Hargreaves. Uh, James impacted the world with his influential invention. Um, he was a key contributor towards the Industrial Revolution. Uh, that began in Great Britain in the late 1700s. Hargreaves made the spinning jenny, which changed the face of textile manufacturing. He was born in Blackburn, England, and uh, was didn't have any education his whole life. Hargreaves' home of Lancaster was a center of productions in England. Uh, as Hargreaves became more involved with loom making, he began experimenting a new machine that could spin more threads at once. Um, it is said that his daughter, Jenny, accidentally knocked over his experiment, so he decided to name it the Spinning Jenny. In 1764, Hargreaves had built the Spinning Jenny. The machine worked by threading eight spindles at once by turning a spinning wheel. The spinning jenny was safe for children to use, so it was big for people back then. Um, it wasn't until 70, 1770 that Hargreaves applied for a patent on the spinning jenny, and since he already sold multiples, he was declined. Um. As with most inventions, others began improving upon Hargreaves' design, like Richard Arkwright and Samuel Crompton are also credited <laughs> are also credited with final perfecting mechanical spinning. The machines evolved, eventually employing 18 to 120 spin spindles. It was incredible. Um, Hargreaves died on April 22nd in 1778. So as you can see, uh, James Hargreaves was very influential in the Industrial Revolution and greatly impacted the world and the revolution with his machinery. Thanks for watching guys, have a great day.